Mr. Riddle, you and defendant have known each other for a long time. And there came a point when the two of you were riding in a car together. Were you out together on a date? I mean, we was on our way to church. Uh, me and my son was going to church and we invited Shamika and her boys to go with us as well. And there was an accident. Yes, ma'am. And the accident was the fault of the other driver. Yes, ma'am. So this is what I gather that you said to the defendant that you had had some history of being able to negotiate with insurance companies, so you thought it was probably unnecessary to have a lawyer to whom you would have to give a percentage of whatever recovery there was, and you felt perfectly confident that you could negotiate a settlement with the insurance company yourself. Yes, ma'am. And Ms. Roberts agreed to give you power of attorney to negotiate with the insurance company on her behalf. Yes, ma'am. While you were in in the process of negotiating with the insurance company, the defendant needed some cash. Yes, ma'am. And she acknowledges that, that during the course of your negotiating with the insurance company, you loaned her as an advance against the settlement $4,200. Is that correct? Yes, ma'am. When was that? He actually deposited the money into my account on December the 1st of, of what 2017. Year? And it was your understanding that that money was to be paid back? Yes, ma'am, that is when correct. When the settlement, and you were confident that the settlement would be greater than the $4,200? Yes, ma'am. By that time, we had our, I was already negotiating with the insurance company. The first offer they made for Shamika and her family was $2,800. She wanted to accept that, and I told Mika, don't accept that because it's not worth what we're trying to get done. So I reached back out to the insurance company, and I put Shamika on the phone with the insurance company because they had to hear her voice say she declined the offer of 2800 which she did on a tape recording. So we went farther and I ended up negotiating up, up to 15000 which was still a little short of what we needed for the medical bills and the personal injury. So I opened up an uninsured motors claim on Shamika we have with her insurance company, which gave us an extra surplus to cover everything that we needed. Sounds to me as if you really understand. If you get cheated a couple of times, Yana, you learn some stuff. Is that what happened? Yes, ma'am. Me and my son got in an accident before, and I feel like the lawyer took more money than we got from it, from what we went through, so I just learned how to do it myself. So the settlement with regard to Miss Roberts' claim, the entire settlement was how much in cash? 20000 How much money did you receive? In total, I received $14,850. Yana, if you had um, 4200 that I sent her, that you'd bring her to the, uh, almost to the 20000 that I told you about. No, I understand that. The point is, she says she received fourteen eight. Yes, ma'am. That's the entire settlement is what I received, the fourteen eight. He sent you the check. Right. He sent me... He yes. sent you a check for $14,850. Yes, ma'am. He actually sent me three checks. The checks that ended up coming to him. And he sent me one check for $9,150. Hold on. $9,150. Hold on. He sent Hold a on. second check Just for $1,000. And the third check was for $1,100. Those are the checks that he sent to me. The, That's 11250 That is correct. The other 37 that came from my insurance company, they sent those directly to me. The issue is he wants his $4,200 back. Well, Just a second. Yes, ma'am. Your answer says he's been paid, right? So you acknowledge that he loaned you $4,200. Yes, ma'am. Now it's up to you to show me that you paid him. Okay, well, um, Your Honor... Uh, when we got in the accident in December, uh, listen when me. he called me on the phone no. and I... <laughs> yes, ma'am. You acknowledge that he loaned you $4,200... Yes, ma'am. ...to repay to him when the case settled. He... W Just, I want you to show me the simple figure that he got more money for you to the tune of $4,200, and he kept that for himself. That's what you have to show me, yes, and he kept that and sent you what we would call a net check. 